Hello, welcome. Let's solve this problem together. You might try it on your own first, though. So if you want to try it on your own, press play, give it a shot, and then uh, so you press pause, give it a shot, and press play when you want to solve it with me. All right, this is a system of equations question, and that means that there's multiple parameters to the problem. We set it up and solve for the variables. Most, most fun. Uh, so a total of 165 pounds of apples and peaches. That's our first parameter. The apples and peaches, the pounds of apples and peaches equals 165. And then the price of apples is $1.75 per apple, and the price per peaches is $2.50 per peach. And the total amount she's making is $337.50. And we want to know how many pounds of peaches um, did she sell. So. In order to solve for P, we've got to get rid of A. So I'm going to multiply everything in the first equation by negative 1.75. But once I do that, we'll be able to cancel out A, because we'll have opposite values in these terms. Let's see what that looks like. Negative 1.75A uh, minus 1.75P equals 165 times 1.75. I know it's negative, but I'm too lazy to answer the negative sign. I'll just flip this result. It's negative 288.75. And now we've got to add that to this equation in here. We're going to add these two. So 1.75a plus 2.5p equals 337.5. Now when we add these two equations, we can add equations just like we add numbers. If we add these two equations here, these terms are opposites that cancel out, and now we can solve for p. We get 0.75p equals 48.75. Figure out negative 288.75 plus 337.5. We divide both sides by 0.75, right? Use a calculator for this. When or do it by hand if you'd like. Um, P is going to equal 65. That's the number of peaches that were sold, which is choice three. If you need to find the number of apples, you can just plug into the first equation. Apples plus 65 peaches equals 165, and that means there's 100 apples, right? Because 100 plus 65 is 165. Notice they put that choice here, kind of tricky, in choice four. But we're not interested in apples here, just peaches. Thanks.